Welcome back everyone, day 18. Please hit like and subscribe. Um, just got a bunch more done today. Uh, cutouts around the uh, doors and windows, they do fit. So they're pretty much set. I'm just gonna put the outer skin and then ride her to the inside, which is easy at this point. Um, side wall in, again, I'm gonna put the uh, hot water heater there. I bought a Pelican case, so that's fine. Um, short Memorial Day, so only did about five, six hours today. Got some bracing in for the outside and inside skin. Um, finished up some of the uh, insulation. It's got a couple, a little bit more uh, router gouged out there, but no big deal, it fits. Um, gonna put roof racks mount there and there, so extra supports. Doors all set. Um, did get, what I'm gonna put here is that diesel heater. Um, Kind of, it's hard to see, but basically what I did was I uh, cut out, made it a little bit bigger on the bottom, and then put wood there um, underneath, and then also uh, use the uh, deck, uh, the uh, fence post paint in there, gave it some clearance. So hopefully that's enough clearance. I got to uh, just double check, but that basically sits right on top of it, and the exhaust and intake go in there. Got some high... Um, temp silicone that I'll put in there. I'm gonna mount the uh, tank right there for the diesel tank um, for the fuel, put in a back support there so I have something to drill in, hold it nice and tight. Um, that's basically it today. Just a lot of work, I did about five hours or so and that's it. Um, insides coming along, did get the insulation cut for the top and that's fine. Now I just got to skin the top uh, with the inner layer of um, one eighth plywood. And then I'll be able to start running all the uh, wires. So I am going to put a, uh, a bolt here to do a chassis ground. So I forget that's fine. I just got to weld that in there and that'll be a good spot because I plan on having converter, inverter, uh, solar panel, everything else, it's all gonna be in this box. Just kind of playing out with the layout. So obviously batteries on the bottom, and then I'm gonna uh, probably put a back shelf there to support the inverters, kind of large. Um, so I can kind of figure that out, but I'm gonna run all the wires up along the wall here. And then what you could see is in between where the, um, one second, let me, in between basically the bottom and the top is going to be like a channel there so i figure i can run all the wires along there um i plan on putting five lights on the interior um basically two and two and then one in the middle it's going to be a fan in the second cube um one of those fantastic fans and then i can run a wire i'm going to have another uh blue bus fuse panel in the back so that way I can run off more wires and more lights back there um, to have everything done. So, and I plan on putting lights inside both cabinets and then also run underneath the trailer a couple lights. So I did order those from Amazon. So I just got to see how I like those and then order more if I do. Um, and then I'll put some lights in the back and I just got to skin the inside here, build the cabinets, which I'll do this weekend for the front and the inside and the back here. Um, at least have those done and then skin and then I got to start cutting the skin for the outside and start um, getting that all ready to put on fiberglass and then uh, paint. I'm going to use a marine top coat. We'll see how that goes. And I think that's pretty much it. So everything I think wiring is going to take a lot of time. Um, but hopefully once I have the roof on the inside or the ceiling on the inside done, um, that'll give me uh, some support. And also too, I plan on buying a one inch um, piece of wood going from this all the way to the front and continue the back to give a little bit more support, but also something to screw in all the wires too. Um, bought those um, plastic holders. So I think that's pretty much it. Front holes for air conditioning if you missed that one. Um, but just went around today, polyed inside, glued, did everything else, all the insulation's cut, so should start coming together pretty quickly at this point, hopefully. Um, but please click like, hit subscribe, any questions, let me know, um, but or suggestions as well. So thank you very much and talk to you soon. Hit like.